Lenore von Stein, and this is a uh, TV series called The Facts. It's another episode of The Facts. And I'm here tonight with Andrew Bolotowski, Rachel Evans, and Bern Nix. And we're rehearsing for a piece that we're going to do later tonight uh, uh, called, I call Building a Character after the idea of I've started my life in art as an actor, and I'm still absolutely in love with the whole process, although I was never really very good at it. And um, the thing that that I absolutely adore about it is this this uh, thing of, of of finding 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 parts of yourself in whatever character you're playing. So it's not phony. This is method acting. It's not phony what you're doing because it's pieces of yourself, and it is enlightening. It is your soul falls out of your mouth which is what I try to do as a musician, too, in front of the audience. They see it the same time you see it. How? Where was my soul? Now I'm controlling. You can't see my soul. I can't see it either. So let's let's try this tune next to new, and this is actually um, well, they were all rehearsals, but this is <coughs> okay. Yeah. Okay. Uh, this is actually re uh, well. Let's rehearse this thing next to new for viola and flute. Um, so you want to just take it from the top? Okay. Okay. What do we have a cue? Thank you. The person that, uh, are you feeling all right? Yeah. Okay. Try not. Okay. Sorry about that. No problem. The person that I'm, I'm, I'm trying, I'm, I'm drawing in this, in this episode coming up, it's, it's, it's a very stiff person. And the more I thought, you know, kind of a, a kiss my ass kind of person, and the kind of, the kind of, the kind of thing that, in, in fantasy, sometimes you, you, 
you, well, I just talk about myself. I'd like to be like, I wish I had told them, da da da. I wish I had told them, da da. And it's always this kind of, you know, close the door kind of uh, comment that that ends the ends the tribulation. Mm -hmm. And uh, and but it, it it's 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 this this kind of very um, stiff. Um, oh, I had an insight. Oh my God, I come from a long line of alcoholics. And, um, and one of the things of the, the children of alcoholics, I wasn't a child of alcoholics, but some of the people I related to were, one of the, chi one of the things there is is this kind of stiffness, um, you know, like sh shells and arrows and stuff, they're, they're fending them off. Uh, but but the, the survivors of, of that, of, you know, probably not just alcohol, of, of, of that people acting in ways that you can't predict and aren't nice at the same time. You know, if, it's, if they were suddenly very, if it was very nice and you couldn't predict it, that wouldn't be a problem. Um. <laughs> Okay, so my stiff character be alternating with a kind of oh, oh, saccharine cutesy. S stiff, kiss my, and then. All of which exists within me. going to be happy or at least, you know, survive. So let's, could you work on Alfred Hitchcock's construction? I'm very interested in how Alfred Hitchcock mm -hmm. built his stories, but not interested enough to study it, but just mm -hmm. write about it. <laughs> <laughs> so what's the cue? Well, it's Me. Nola. Moi. Yes. Okay.
I just want to say that one of, one of the reasons, I, while they were playing, I was thinking, he was listening and thinking, and one of the things that, that's also part of this character, we're in the, this, as we speak, it's, it's December 2011, and the Republicans are doing this amazing dance, like, like witches in the forest or something, gremlins in the forest with each other, and, and they're all these stiff fools. It's just, it, it's the coin of the realm. Try it again. think it was better is there a, a part of it you want to look at it again burn or well yeah the beginning in the middle and the end uh, <laughs> <laughs> I don't have that technique but, but you know <laughs> I, I, I want to amend what I said before, the Republicans like witches, because I don't want to put down women, you know. They're like gremlins in the, or, some, or something. I don't even want to put down gremlins, you know. I, uh, <laughs> you know, women are 50 percent of every population, and one of, the, one of the how far we are removed from democracy is one, one measure of it is the treatment of women and the attitude towards women, women, women. Um, yeah, uh, I just saw uh, uh, Akira Kurosawa's uh, Drunken Angel. I hadn't seen it in a long time. I'm, I'm big, I like Akira Kurosawa. And, um, and it, it's a story about this doctor who's trying to take care of this gangster, this Yakuza. Uh, and uh, the guy is going to die of TB, but he still won't stop drinking, won't stop smoking, won't stop doing all these things. He's thin as a rail, and he's, he's uh, and so the, and the doctor is drunk and angry, and they throw things back and forth. They're trying to get him to do things. And the, and the gangster also is a very nice person who likes him, a, a woman who likes him. And so in the end, after the gangster finally does die, 
Um, the doctor, one nice character, confides this what I've got written, and, and confides to another nice character, the, the woman who loves the gangster. Uh, they're sitting next to this really filthy pool of water. It's Japan, just post the war, and um, and in this terribly impoverished village, and um, and and. And she and she and, and she has this insight about the bad guy, and and I don't remember the insight, but anyway, she has this insight about the bad guy. And what struck me about it is when she said it, when she said it at the end of this movie, it was an insight that that, like many insights, I think, that everyone knows but nobody says. And she just said it about him, and it was instantly recognizable because it was. Everybody knows it, just nobody says it. And um, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. censorship makes you mean. Mm -hmm. I mean, maybe my point, maybe what I'm trying to say is they were nice, so they were able to think. They were nice enough, to, they were happy enough with to be able to think and communicate with one another more clearly than these gangsters who would just of the good guy, somebody who's I love you, I love you, I do, but don't get excited, I love monkeys too. So let's try um, finding, well, let's try, let's try, no, let's try, let's try, let's try breakup. Let's try breakup. Let's try breakup. You guys were looking at that before, right? No, you weren't. Did it once. The Fulte gives the cue. Yeah, the Fulte gives the first cue. I am the Fulte. Bar five, full tea. Okay. Okay. You'll <coughs> see it, don't you? Good. Yes, I do. Good. Very good. Full tea. Shh. Full tea sounds like the name of a character in a Joseph Heller novel. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> I like it very much. <laughs> It's flute, you know, misspelled. <laughs> okay, so ready. Uh, you'd like your cue. I will yes. give it to you. Yes, I'm ready. I'm a woman, and that means something other. Check. 
Because I was stuttering. Well, there are three stutters. Boy, you stayed with me very, very. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Uh, That's one of the principles of music, you know, that you put all the events on a page, you see, and you can sort of see them laid out before you. Really. Well, that's one of the ideas, I believe. <laughs> and with all of our fine education, we go in there and we change it all around, right? See? <laughs> fine education. Deep do re re bo do baby re 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 you don't want to be caught up in a melody you've heard before for too long. I was, uh, yes, a couple days ago, the leader of North Korea died, and I was watching Democracy Now! trying to get some actual information. And um, they had a couple people from talk about North Korea, and one of them was a, um, a human rights person who, she said, when I, she, I think she's Korean American anyway, when she, she said, when I was in uh, Pyongyang, the head of the capital of North Korea, people kept on, they, I was being guided around shown, and they kept on pointing to this one building, and I couldn't figure out why they keep on pointing to this one building. And it turned out that that was the only building that was left standing after the Americans bombed the rest of that city. There was one building left standing, and they haven't forgotten that, you know, they're <laughs> pointing the building. This is the only building we have left. <laughs> Everything else was built afterwards because the Americans killed everything. Boop. Boop. Got that part right. Boop. 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 We had our reasons. Very good reasons. And why do the why do the North Koreans want a nuclear bomb so that they don't end up like Iraq?
As we... As we... Shuffle off... As we shuffle off this... These tired stories... I don't mean my stories. The tired stories that surround us. That's America to me. See you now, but see ya. <laughs>